Hello, everybody. Welcome to episode 14 of Haven Cave Block, where we start our progression into refined storage. So let's jump into it. Okay, everybody. Uh, so today, we're, we're going to, one, upgrade our power situation here. Um, like, I could take all of these magnators and these energized rods uh, and put them into this transmutation tablet that we made last episode. But today, before we get started into doing that, I would like uh, to upgrade our transmutation tablet into a er, table into a tablet. Yes, I I've been saying tablet. Uh, we need some dark matter, which is relatively a complex thing. We're just going to need some coal here. Okay. Uh, and what we'll do is take this along with four coal, and we'll get the alchemical coal. Now we can teach this to it, get uh, four pieces of alchemical coal. Uh, and upgrade that to the next tier of coal, since we do need the dark uh, matter. So get the Mobius fuel. Four Mobius fuels. And I think the next tier is the Atronalis fuel. Yes. Now with this, we're going to need eight of a uh, these guys and one diamond block and that will make us the dark matter that we need now I can't remember was it dark matter blocks that we needed oh first let, let's get that dark matter block made Just, just in case, I got to check here. Yeah, it's dark matter blocks. So we're going to need three of these dark matter blocks. Uh, I did make a transmutation table between episodes and taught it to the system. And now we need living wood. Our living logs. Let's see here. Uh, six for each. So 24 to make all the cores. And we're going to need at least one more Terra Steel ingot. Uh, Terra Steel, yep. Can't be taught to the system. No recipe for it with the system, but that's fine. Now we can use this, and now we've got the transmutation tablet, which now wherever we go, we've got access to everything that we've taught to the system. I, I did teach it, so we have access to it. Uh, everything that we had in all of these chests, this is what's left. Uh, also, we can take the essences now, straight, and say we want uh, any essence, we can request it. Uh, the only one is not the Awakened Supremiums, but we can get the stuff to make it out of the transmutation tablet. Uh, I was teaching this stuff to it, like I was going through here and going, oh, let's grab all of this and toss it right in there. So I'm going to have to look at a way to compacting that all down so that it's in the EMC right away. So 
Now, back over here to these guys. And we're going to have to upgrade our energy production with these. So, do you, isn't that the recipe, though? Isn't that the recipe with power? Do you get the hardened steel? Oh, no, it's steel ingots and electrum. Okay. I'm cool with that. I'm cool with that. Uh, are we making steel? I can't remember if we are yet. No. Nope. Not making steel. But. We can uh, cheese a little bit here. I know that is a recipe there that requires one million energy. Uh, that's the spirited essence. So steel and electrum. Let's look at making that. Regular steel. We can make steel seeds, which not really going to be needed. Not with us having EMC. Uh, steel dust. So we're going to have to get into a little bit of mechanism. That's fine. Uh, metallurgic infuser. Let's just check here. Yeah, we don't have that yet, so... Uh, what we're gonna need is two furnaces, which we haven't taught. An osmium ingot, an iron ingot, and redstone. So, osmium ingots we have here. Iron ingots here. And furnaces. We're going to need cobble. Alright, so let's make all of this. Let's make three of these. I mean, why not, right? We can now teach it metallurgic infusers just so we have them. We can have the osmium and that type of stuff. Uh, we're going to need iron and two pieces of coal. Which you did see we already taught to the system. We come over here where there is power. It's slowly taking power. Uh, and we'll put one piece of coal in there, which gives us 10 pieces of carbon, which then we put this iron ingot in. It's still producing that, which is fine. And we get the enriched iron. Don't know if we're going to need enriched iron to be taught, but, you know, it's better to be safe than sorry. Another carbon, another enriched iron. 82. Good. And now we've got the steel blend. Again, don't know if we're going to need just the blend there for any future crafting, but, you know, save myself a little bit of a headache later on and just do it that way. Okay, so now. Still blend. Okay, so now, Electrum blend. Electrum. 
It's made with steel and silver. I do know that. Uh, we could toss gold, silver, and a fire charge. Okay, so let's get the suffer fire charge, which is blaze powder. A piece of coal. And gunpowder. Get some fire charges. And silver is here. Gold is here. Taught you that. Let's get you taught with the silver fire charges you have now. And that is that. Nope, not that. That, that, and that. Gets blended up, makes the electrum. Ah, good, good. We've got our spirited crystal, so. Oh! Oh, those are not... Ooh. Interesting. Let's uh, do this real quick. Okay, we get the energized steel. That is not taught to the system. Okay, so just the, the basics can be taught to the system. Hmm. I thought we could do do a little bit of a cheating method on that. I guess not. <clears throat> hmm. I'll be right back once I figure out what I'm going to do with the rest of this episode, guys. Okay, I am going to get back into power this episode. Uh, I'm just putting away the initial uh, power stuff that we have done for right this moment. Um, and we are going to clean up this area a little bit because we need to put down our first production line in here. Wrench. Get this wrench. Right. Close that up for right now. Permanently, I guess. And that looks this this looks better for for the wear. Alright. Take that out of here. Put that away. And now at refine. Um, I would like to get into refined storage a little bit this episode. So we're going to need a bit of raw processors, raw processors here. And to do that, we need to have three deployers and one, uh, hammer this guy right here. So we could actually take this guy right here uh, just for a second so we can just teach our system the mechanical press. Get us out one for that. And there we go. That's back up and running again. 
Uh, do we have shafts taught to this yet? Yes, we do. Okay, we'll take a stack of shafts. We'll take a stack of uh, chain drives. What, four? Yeah, four. So yeah, five should be fine to have on us. And we'll just make this come over, say, right here should be good. To uh, set this up. Uh, to make these raw processors, we're going to need deployers. Okay, so... Lawyer. There we go. To make a deployer, we're going to need electron tubes, andersite casing, and brass hands. I think we've taught it brass. Um, we have not taught it the casings yet. So we're going to need an axe real quick. Uh, one. One oak log. Set down the oak log, strip it, andersite casing, pick it up. Teach that to this. A brass hand is an andersite. That, yep. Four of these. Okay, so we should be able to make the brass hand for this. There we go. I don't think that this is useful except in making deployers. So let's see here. Yeah, that, that's, well, actually, an extendo grip. Okay, so there is another purpose. Uh, and electron tubes, which we've already taught. So now we can make a deployer. Teach that to this. Grab out the other two deployers that we're going to need for this setup. And we're going to set up the casings. Like so. Uh, we're going to have to wrench you the right way. Okay, so what if I place, and we want to make sure that there is no item being filtered on those just yet. Uh, actually, we should filter these out. Let's let's get the binding, which is slime balls and string. Okay, we can make this here, get some processor bindings, just keep one on us for right now, and say you can only hold processor bindings, so we can hold, hand you that, and on this guy, uh, what is the next step for the raw uh, at refined storage? 
Is it redstone? No, silicon. How do we get silicon? Uh, is Certus Quartz smelted? Or... Nether Quartz smell. Okay, so... Um... Quartz? Yeah, we have Quartz. Toss another quartz up in here. Get this out. Teach you how to make that. <laughs> now we can put that on the filter here. And now you have a silicon. Okay, so. Again. And you should be redstone, if I'm not mistaken. Let's uh, do at refined again. Oh. Just trying to type it into that. All right. Uh, yeah, redstone. So we'll filter redstone with you. And you guys are coming down. What? One? So. If I'm not mistaken. Place this here, this here. And do we have dried kelp taught to this? I think we do. Get six of those out. And now we've got the belt. Okay, the belt goes like that. Now you've all stopped. All right, and next thing we're going to need is funnels. Do we have funnels, Todd? No, but we should have chutes, Todd. Wait, uh, funnels. Okay, so it's an electron tube, brass ingot, and dried kelp. A kelp and a brass ingot. Okay, so now teach you those. So now we've got brass funnels if we ever need these again. And hmm. Yeah, yeah. Did I teach you the belts? Because I would like to have a belt as well. Now. Uh, should be able to come off this side. And you know what? No, better yet. Uh, let's grab 
three chain drives. Case chain drives. For this. Okay, that is going the wrong direction. So, place them on this side. And yeah, they're still going the wrong direction. Which means we're going to need a gearbox. We don't need this gearbox here anymore. Each the gearbox here. Set this here. And now they're rotating the right way. So now we need two chests. Okay. We'll set this chest up on this side. I can put it in the right spot. And we'll set this chest up on this side. And we'll set the funnel here. We might have to extend that. We'll see here in just a second. Uh, and we need a piece of iron. We'll make our first raw and then I'll, I'll make a stack of these guys here. All right, so we can make, we can do this with one raw processor. And to build these guys up with their uh, needed items, we're going to get pipes. Uh, we're going to get item pipes uh, and pipe wrench. And we're going to do this here. And I was up there. I messed up on my jump. All right. So this, this this and this. We'll, we'll de-wrench this guy here like this. And now we can say I want uh, iron, a stack of iron, uh, binders, stack of binders, redstone, and silicon. Okay. And we can stick this in here so that oh uh We're going to need to filter that. Okay, so. And yeah, yeah, we're going to need to go get a filter, so. This gets filtered right. Um, yeah, I'll make the filter and I will be right back after uh, I get some raw processors done up.
Okay, with just a little bit of uh, processing, I made uh, raw ones for the gold, diamond, and basics. Uh, which they get put into here, turned into processor bindings. The basics, the improved, and the advanced. Uh, and so with that done here, uh, let's let's look at what we need now. We need a controller, which requires one diamond, um, some silicon quartz, which is or uh, quartz enriched iron. That's it need three iron and one quartz to make this uh, go in here. Rotate this. Right. Quartz enriched iron, taut. So now we can get just a stack of that just as easy as we please. Uh, we can make the controller. We're going to need a machine casing. And we can actually teach the machine casings to this system. So that is going to save us a lot of headache. Um, machine casing. And now we can just do controller which we just need some silicon. Grab a stack of that out. All right, so now that we've got the controller, we're going to need a grid, which is a construction, a deconstruction, and another improved uh, one a construction is uh, I'm gonna need quartz for this. Okay, so construction is nether quartz and no, not the transmutation type. Basic processor that gives us the deconstruction. The glowstone what that gives us the construction. Got those. We should have uh, that in the wrong spot. We'll, we'll place that down here in just a second. Um, we'll have to get glass out. Okay, so we've got glass. And now we can make us a grid after we get one of those cores out. Wait, what is it? A casing, sorry. Get a stack of casings out. So we can have the grid here. I want to turn it into a crafting grid, which requires a advanced processor and um, crafting table, which we have not taught to the system. There we go. Fans processor. And with the grid there, now we have a crafting grid. So now we can craft with the stuff that we need. Uh, we're going to need some cables here, which sports enriched, sports enriched iron. Can we not? Oh, we're lacking redstone. Okay, so there we go. 
you teach the cables to this. And now we should be able to make uh, external storages, which requires construction, deconstruction, and an improved processor. So, simple enough. We already know how to make all of that. Okay, so toss those guys up there. And an external storage would just need chests. Okay, so we should be able to get an external storage. I want to make another external storage for something here in just a second. Oh, we're just going to need some tiny coal. All right. Uh, I know this is an extended episode, guys, but... My original uh, plan for this episode fell through. All right, so, and I, I really wanted to get into having uh, refined storage. Okay, so what we can do with these external storages is set one here. I didn't make the second external storage. And one on this guy here with uh, some cables between the two. Uh, we'll set the controller here with the crafting grid on top of it. Now the controller needs power, so let's get into uh let's grab the magmator uh and the cables for for the for that uh system. Set that down here. We're gonna set that there. Get a bucket out um get a bucket of lava teach this system buckets of lava so we can just power this right now with lava from a bucket we can get more buckets of lava like so can fill that up as we need and if we look in here everything that's in these uh, and this storage here we have access to well I would like to have access to what's in our transmutation tablet as well uh, and to be able to do that We're first going to need some red matter. Uh, so we can teach this red matter. Get some red matter blocks. Which, uh, simple enough. And you notice we're, we're running low on EMC right at this moment. Don't worry, don't worry. We can come in here and grab blocks of this type of stuff here. Just toss them right up in here to give us our uh, EMC that we are going to be needing. Uh, and 
we're going to need more EMC. More EMC, yes, that, that, that's going to be the quest, our, our next big thing is uh, making EMC production a priority. Okay, so now that we've got that much EMC in there, we're going to grab out one of these transmutation tables here. Uh, with that, uh, red matter blocks and four hoppers. We're, we're going to need to get out four hoppers. And the processing of two of these, one of these. Uh, grab that, the quartz as well. Okay, we did all that. Get that. Get construction, deconstruction. Proved. Okay, so, oh, also a cable. Uh, can toss this, this. Get the importer. Uh, wait, what is it? External storage. Oh, 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 that's right. Uh, chest, two of them. A quartz enriched iron. Okay, so now we get the external storage. And we place these four hoppers here these four red matter blocks here and this transmutation table and we get this EMC interface. We can teach this to this system. And as you can see right now, we do not have any EMC uh, interfaces in here. So we're going to take a uh, Set this guy here, an external storage like that, and now we can say we can see EMCable stuff in here, like the cogwheels and that type of stuff. So now we have access to our EMC stuff where our, um, so between. This episode and next, I'm going to get more uh, EMC set up uh, or, or more EMC into our system just by taking these blocks here and getting them into the system. So if you like this episode, hit that like button. If you dislike this episode, go right ahead, hit that dislike Leave a comment down below why you dislike this episode. Uh, if you have not done so yet, hit that subscribe. It does help out the channel. And until next time, later Gators.